Welcome to Roverville, an up-and-coming cozy island with tons of potential. Don't let the flowers and gloom deter you. The overcast skies add texture to the natural and minimalist landscape. This island features quaint neighborhoods full of wonder and homes designed with focal points to captivate your attention. Let's go and check out all of the features Roverville has to offer. Here is the map of Roverville. It looks like we have a lot of cute villagers. We have Bones and Ellie, Chev, Bree. There's a little neighborhood up top. There's a couple neighborhoods up top. A campsite on the top of the hill. That's pretty cool. I like the way that the mountains are terraformed and that centerpiece. I'm very interested to see what that looks like. So let's go check it out. We have the Arville flag and lots of tulips. So I'm not sure if tulips are the natural one or just whatevs, but we have a cute neighborhood down here. And here's the entry. Nice green airport. Very cool. I believe this is one of the beginning furniture pieces to put outside of this house. This looks like Lucha's house here. And we have a nice little river along. Unfortunately, I can't jump across the river, so we are going to be restricted to whatever bridges they make. Oh, this is cute. This is like a very nifty way to make a fake bridge with a nice money bag tree in the middle. Beautiful. So this is very, very wholesome in its own way where it's it has a lot of like that early game aesthetic to it, but there's definitely been terraforming stuff happening here. We have the museum over here next to the Able Sisters shop. Chevron, it's a goat on a beach. Goat on a beach. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Some nice terraforming with the waterfall here. And it looks like there's some big plans happening. So I really enjoy this cliff back here. This is very well, well done. And I feel like this is like where the potential is going to be. Nice little neighborhood back here. Very close together. Reminds me of Texas houses, how they're all smooshed together like this. I have a feeling this is where the museum was, but I'm interested to see where that goes to. Another neighborhood. Ooh, we have a nice little orchard down here. Very cute. All of the fruits you'll need. Hopefully there'll be more fruits someday. Maybe, maybe soon. Maybe we'll get bananas and stuff. Maybe we'll get persimmons. It would be nice. And here is their house. Let's go on inside. Ooh, very fancy. We have the TV. We're nice and close to the couch if they want to do... Enjoy watching TV for a little while. We'll turn it on. We'll see what, what they had watching. Cartoons, of course. We have a cozy bathroom in here. Very functional with the toilet. Fancy toilet. I like that the toilet matches the rack up here, too. That's really nice. Contrast with the, with the pink. We have a kitchen slash laundry room. Very minimalist, but very cozy. I feel like the flower toast actually goes really well with this table runner. A cozy little bedroom. Is this a bedroom? We're not sure yet. There's no bed in here. What would you call this room if you had this room in your house? The storage room? The I just moved in room room? <laughs> Ooh, fancy bedroom. You know, some people, some people say that bedrooms are just for sleeping and should be for nothing else. I feel like this room really emphasizes that point and that they take that advice to the extreme because they have just a bed in here. But it's a nice bed. They clearly spent all of their money on the bed itself. You know what? That's what that back room is for. That back room that we saw earlier, that's to hold all their clothes in the boxes. This is just the bedroom exclusively. And there's no basement, so we'll just head, head on out and check out the rest of the town. Nate's hanging out, Lucha's hanging out, lots of wilderness. And then we have the Nook Mile shop. Nook Mile shop? The Nook shop. Very cute. I wish that the Nook shop could be open during dreams. It'd be fun to see what they sell. I kind of like this like kind of gloomy overcast day that they chose as well. Oh look, some beach stuff. Nice relaxing time at the beach. We'll hang out. And I think that's really the nice features that this island has to offer. We hope you've enjoyed your trip to Roverville. Please enjoy your visit while you're here and write what you enjoyed most about your visit in the guest book below. Thank you so much and see you on the next island visit. Bye!